Welcome back to your channel, Learning More with Prerna. So today I'm back with an important topic and an important video on civil service and its features. So friends, what is civil service and what are the features of civil service? So the word civil service was first used by East India Company. And when we talk about civil service, we uh, our mind will divert or our mind will straight away go to the same word or the points like Indian Police Service, IPS officers, IAS officers, IFS officers. So, what do we mean by civil services? All these services like Indian Police Service or Indian Administrative Service. So, when we talk about the features, the features would be like it's a professional body. The exam conducted, the uh, body which conducts the exam, the selection process, where the body which does that, it is a professional body. They are very, very professional, highly professional people will be working there. They'll be having very, uh, you know, proper amount of uh, attention will be given. They'll be having proper amount of training. They'll be having proper amount of uh, knowledge that whom they have to hire and what kind of exam they need to conduct, when to conduct, what are the questions that will be there in the exams and what type of candidate they need to hire after conducting the interviews. The next important feature would be hierarchy. In civil services, we can see there is an hierarchy of services. So these services are hierarchical services, whereas when we talk about service like Indian Police Service, if a person is allotted or if a person is appointed, he will be getting promoted. So here we can see there is hierarchy and there is a person superior and another people following them. So this creates a hierarchy in this particular system or particular body. Then we talk about political neutrality is another feature. So friends, these people, civil service, the body is neutral. The IPS officers or the IS officers, whoever is appointed and the appointing body, they are politically neutral. They are not at all, uh, you know, into any political party. They won't support any particular political party or any political agenda. So they are politically neutral. Nowhere they are related to politics. The next thing would be permanent. Whoever is hired for this position or whoever is the member of this body, they are permanent members. They'll be working here with the, with the community or uh, they'll be working with the organization until they retire or until the age of superannuation. That would be 60 years. Normally it is 60 years. So until they retire, they'll be working with the same organization. So it is a permanent kind of job. They'll be hired on a permanent basis. The next thing would be service motto. The people, whoever is appointed and the people who is working in the organization, they are of the motto that service. Service is the only motto they'll be having. Some jobs will be having the motto of, you know, targets. Some job will be having the service of making money. Some jobs will make us to have the uh, motto of making, uh, you know, investment. But this particular organization and this particular jobs, they are service motto. They want to serve the society, serve the nation, serve the humankind. So last but not the least, it is uh, providing special kind of training. So the IAS, IPS and IFS officers, whoever is getting selected, whoever clears the exam, they'll be given special, um, special training in different, you know, uh, training centers. So they will be trained physically, mentally and they will be trained in such a way that they can serve our society and our nation with their full heart and mind so that there should be you know, no mistake committed by them. So friends, these were some of the important features of civil service. Hope this video will be helpful for you in your exams or for your civil service exams or for a general knowledge point of view. So I'll be back with another important and interesting video. If you find it interesting, please do like, share, and subscribe to support my channel, subscribe it, and I'll be back very soon. Thank you friends, have a good day.